All right, so I'm gonna go over the ingredients in our new product, Leviathan Nutrition GI Support. And the first ingredient that I wanna go over on the list um, is you probably not heard about it. It's pretty new in the supplement space and that is tributrin. So before we get a little bit into tributrin, I wanna explain what short chain fatty acids are. So short chain fatty acids, otherwise abbreviated as SCFAs, are the gut's preferred fuel source for energy. And it produces these SCFAs by fermenting dietary fiber into these SCFAs. Now butrate is the um, most efficient form of short chain fatty acids that the gut is able to ferment fiber into. So the gut uses SCFAs as a fuel source that regulates um, basically all mechanisms related to gut function. Now the gut's ability to produce short chain fatty acids is dependent on having proper gut bacteria in order to form, ferment those dietary fibers into short chain fatty acids. So tributrin, we can think of as a prebiotic used by the gut in order to produce butrate. And butrate, of course, is the preferred short chain fatty acid used as a fuel source in the gut for proper gut function. But let's look a little deeper in the structure of tributrin. What tributrin really is, is it's a prodrug of butrate. It's three butrate molecules that are linked together by a glycerol molecule. So tributrin is able to get in those target tissues in the stomach and bloodstream, and then it is converted by the enzyme lipase into those three um, butrate molecules by cleaving that glycerol molecule off. So this is very important for improving the absorption of butrate, because if you take just normal butrate, um, there are many issues with this. It undergoes rapid breakdown before the butrate actually reaches the target tissues that we want it to do uh, in order to do its job. So tributrin only gets broken down into those butrate molecules in the cells where lipase enzyme is present, retaining its beneficial function. So clinical doses for tributrin in humans will range anywhere between 500 milligrams to 1,000 milligrams daily. Uh, the optimal dosing in order to have a slow controlled release of tributrin is going to be three times per day. That's why I recommend taking our product uh, three times per day for three meals. So tributrin helps with acting as a main fuel source for colon cells and the small intestine in order to properly break down nutrients. Tributrin produces an adequate amount of butrate, the preferred short-chain fatty acid, as a preferred energy source, which helps to regulate nearly all mechanisms related to gut function. Tributrin helps with providing intestinal support and metabolic health. By supporting the intestinal wall, um, tributrin can reduce gut, gut inflammation and leaky gut symptoms. And it's also important to note that increasing intestinal function and thus decreasing inflammation could really help people who have issues with um, like irritable bowel syndrome, ulcerative colitis, those sort of things, because these sort of issues um, primarily stem from inflammation related causes. Okay, so now looking at the site. Okay, so looking at the supplement facts for Leviathan Nutrition GI support on the site, we can see that we have 400 milligrams of tributrin powder for two capsules. Now this uh, equates to 200 milligrams of actual tributrin. So if you take this three times a day with meals, with three meals, um, that will reach the desired clinical dose of around 600 milligrams per day. So hopefully you guys found this video educational and learned a little bit about tributrin. It's a very interesting ingredient that has plenty of benefits um, as a prebiotic and just for overall gut function, making sure that things are running optimally. Um, if you would like to check out the product, you can go ahead. We are accepting pre-orders for it right now. You can just head on over to the site and make your purchase and stay tuned for uh, future videos in the near future for uh, going over each one of these ingredients in depth like you have seen with this one.